Hi friends, today we are going to talk about uh, one very uh, common problem that you see. So everyone, most of you all use SAP workflow. So if you are using an SAP system, you will be using workflow. And 90% of the companies that uses SAP uses order to cash, sales order. Okay, so if you want to create a workflow for sales order, for some reason, okay, you might see that this is a sales order. I'm going in VA03 transaction, okay. And here, if you see, I just typed in this, generic object service is missing. So you might say, what's that? So that's the, the service for object uh, um, button that helps you to create attachments, that to check invoice, to check workflow logs and all those things. This button I'm talking about. So if I go to a purchase order, it's already available. But for for some reason, in sales order, it will not be available. So it's not a it's not an issue. So what you need to do is you need to add a parameter in your user ID. Okay. So if you go to SE three, okay, and here we will just put a new parameter. So what I'm going to do is I just scroll down. And let me see would be something related with I think I have it open somewhere okay here it is okay the the parameter is sd underscore SWU active okay so I put sd uh, so instead I will just type in since I know what's the parameter it's sd underscore SWU underscore active so I will just put this I will populate this in X and then I will save it. So the moment I do that, this will appear. So let me go out completely. V is 03 and here I am and voila, you have it. So this is the magic that a parameter ID can do for you. Okay, so that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.